President Barack Obama here. What's going on guys? I'm just gonna start this video off by saying I'm not really sure what YouTube is anymore. With that sweet combination of YouTube pranks, YouTube cyber bullies, reaction channels, spicy YouTube drama, people reporting on the YouTube drama, people that try to add to the YouTube drama two weeks after it's over, YouTube cyber bullies calling out the cyber bullies for being cyber bullies, literally fucking porn on YouTube, not a joke, racist Minecraft videos, and of course, random videos like this. Hello YouTube, PigPal2 here, and I'm making this video just to kind of honor all the people who died in the plane crashes in 9-11, because today is 9-11, and in honor of all the people who died, unfortunately, yes, it's very sad, but I have to be happy for this video, I'm going to do a shot of hot sauce. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Did this motherfucker just say that he's going to honor the people that died in 9-11 by doing a shot of hot sauce? What? Honor of all the people who died. Unfortunately, yes, it's very sad, but I have to be happy for this video. I'm going to do a shot of hot sauce. Hi guys, Leafy here. So, as many of you guys know, it's 9-11. Very unfortunate day. You know, a lot of Americans died this day. Uh, really sad stuff. Basically, we took an L. Terrorists win. Anyways, though, today, to honor the people that died in 9-11, people that lost their family members, I've decided that in honor of those people, I'm going to eat a slice of fucking ham with a cucumber. George Washington, Donald Trump, President Barack Obama, this is for you. Let me eat this slice of ham. Alright, so, here... We got the hot sauce, um, and I'm gonna take it and I'm going to pour some of it, ooh, that's spicy, into this cup. I swear to god, you only find this shit on YouTube. You got a kid with a Farmer Joe fucking background honoring people that died in 9-11 by taking a shot of fucking hot sauce. What is next? Hey, what's up, guys? Killer Keemstar here. I'm gonna eat some Cheetos to honor the fucking Holocaust today. Starts yelling, this is for my Jewish brothers as he eats flaming hot Cheetos. After that, of course, we got Pickles for Jesus, where everybody eats big fat pickles for Jesus. This is making a really disgusting sound. Ugh. Alright, here we are with the uh, glass of hot sauce. I don't know how much of it I'm gonna be able to drink. You can see that there, that is hot sauce. Um, no film tricks here, no editing this. Oh, thank god he told us there was no film tricks. I can only imagine the backlash if he got exposed for that. Drop Alert Nation, I'm your host, Killer PewDiePie. Or let's get right into the news. Today we got a huge story for you guys. YouTuber by the name of Pigfucker52 was actually exposed for faking his 9-11 memorial hot sauce service. That's fucking right. Exposed. Fuck that kid. It seems like the backlash has been insane for him as well. Even though he only has 20 subs, he has lost every single subscriber. Take the L, you fuck. But even more than that, not only has he lost every single subscriber, but somehow he's gone into the negative. That's right, we're not really sure how it works, but he seems to be negative 4 million subs in debt. And lately, we've been hearing rumors on Twitter, MySpace, and Facebook that Google is going to be tracking this kid down and taking his parents from him to pay off his subscriber debt. Meme Alert Nation, now over two subscribers and one of the most loved and hated channels. It's a bit ironic that Drumler always finds itself in drama. Anyways, peace the fuck out. Everybody type in the chat, Alex is a stupid nugget. This is pure dangerous. This is gonna be bad. Well, it's not gonna be as bad as that overlay. What the fuck is that? What is that? Is this Papa John's farm with a bunch of pigs that are about to get slaughtered? A bunch of pigs that are about to get their throat slit? Can we just be real for five seconds? How do people find farms cute? Like, I'm not trying to be some sort of animal activist, but you do understand that these farmers are raising these pigs just to fucking kill them, right? And yet, even with that being said, even though the farm is ultimately a fucking slaughterhouse, pretty much a holocaust in smaller numbers, but despite all of that, people find it really cute. Oh, look at the piggy, look at the piggy. That piggy is about to get fucking ended. This is gonna be bad.
Oh my god, he's actually doing it. Holy shit, he's going down on it too. Oh my god. I mean, shit, you gotta give him some props for that, guys. I mean, I wouldn't do that myself, but... <sighs> Why? Oh wait, for 9-11. Almost forgot. They're just mad because they're not free. <laughs> if someone actually gets offended by that, I'm gonna fucking kill myself, I swear to god. I'm gonna straight up try to tackle a train, some crazy shit, dude. I'm gonna put myself in a fucking toaster. I'm gonna fly to Iraq, cosplayed as a Starbucks worker, and try to fist fight everybody there. I'm gonna drive down to Detroit, cosplayed as a KKK member. I'm gonna take some shots of bleach. Oh. You gotta love the playful little music in the background, it really sets the mood, you know? I'm taking shots for the 9-11 victims, okay? You know, the event that got thousands and thousands of people killed? Yeah, I'm gonna be drinking hot sauce for that. Pretty emotional stuff, right? Well, anyways, play this shitty cancer music. Let me tell you, water doesn't help. <laughs> Oh my god, did you guys see that? This motherfucker just slapped his own tongue. He put that bitch in its place. Uh, dude, why did you challenge me to do that? That wasn't nice. Wait a second, someone challenged him to do this? I'm really curious to see who challenged him to do a 9-11 hot sauce challenge. I wonder how that would go. You lose a bet playing fucking horseshoe, right? Friend tells you, okay, okay, I win. This is what you have to do. Make a 9-11 hot sauce challenge video. That wasn't nice. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, dig the pig. What <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> this can't be real life, dude. I swear to God, it just can't. He starts the video off by saying he's going to take hot sauce shots for 9-11 victims. And as if it couldn't get any more disrespectful or bad than that, at the end of the video, he's saying... Dig the pig, motherfuckers. And then he plays clips of 9-11. What? <laughs> Less than a second after he says, dig the pig, he's literally showing clips of thousands of people fucking dying. Like, this can't be real, dude. It just can't. And that's not even bringing up the fact that he captions it as well. Let us take time to remember those who were killed in the attack. Also, dig the pig. Dig the pig. Well, guys, you heard him. Hashtag dig the pig if you care about 9-11 victims. If you don't, and you're a part of ISIS or some shit, well, uh, well, fuck you, dude, and hashtag undig the pig? <laughs> this is already the best meme ever. Dig the pig! And that was also the end of the video as well. I mean, there was a bit more 9-11 footage, but I'm not reacting to that shit. Fuck that. I'm not touching that with a six-foot pole, dude. And I don't feel like looking at 30 videos titled Leafy is here as a cyber bully and hates America. So in conclusion today, if you ever want to pay respects to any horrible thing that's happened in life, just pull out some fucking hot sauce, pull out your webcam, and simply record a video of you drinking the hot sauce, and there you go. You're now officially a respectable person, and hey, just maybe, just maybe, you might actually get popular on myspace.com. Just don't forget to promote a hashtag. Hashtag dig the pig. Case fucking closed. This is making a really disgusting sound. Yeah. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video today, and if you did, dude, it's your lucky day, because not only will you be supporting me, and I will love you long, long time, but if you click the like button on this video, that little single like button, you will be receiving in the mail a fucking spaceship. Yep, as soon as you like this video, a spaceship will uh, magically appear underneath your bed. Check it yourself. This is not a scam. Believe me, guys. On a serious note, though, guys, thank you so much for all the support. Every video lately has been getting like 100,000 likes, which is just... Dude, <laughs> it's fucking crazy, alright? But thank you guys so much. I'm going to be doing a face cam video in the next week or so, so expect that. And again, thanks for watching, and peace, peace. See ya. I love Drumler, by the way.